Hello, grade 10s. For this week's game, we're going to do one similar to what we did last week. Last week, we did the triangles one. The triangle is actually an adaptation of a classic game of dots and boxes. So we're going to go and do a Google search for dots and boxes game. Um, we'll get you here. You can also just click on the link below this uh, post to get us right here. And it's in the uh, cool math games website is one of the versions that we're going to do. So you might have to wait for an ad to go through. And once we do, then we'll skip the ad and we'll get right to the game. So there's a couple of different options you can have how big or small a game you want. You can play one player or two player, uh, and you can decide how difficult you want the computer to be. So I'm just going to leave it as the default, small, normal, and one player. And then we go in here. So you've probably played this game before on pieces of paper where you just make a bunch of dots and then you try and connect all the dots. And so what you're going to do is draw a line. And as you, when you draw a line, the computer will draw a line. And then you keep doing this. The point is for you to complete a box. And when you get to complete a box, then you'll get that point. But you got to be careful that you don't set up one for your uh, opponent. So if I do this one, notice that he's going to take that and get that box. Okay, so we try and we'll take turns going back and forth and making different bot boxes, being very careful that you don't put three sides of the box together and give that box to your opponent. So, for example, if I do this here, it looks like it's okay from down here, but look at above. Oh, there's a freebie I just gave him. So you're going to have to be very careful about this. Hopefully you can get to a point where he'll have to give you some boxes. So, oh, I just gave him one there. Let's be careful. I'm going to go here. And then maybe we can get to keep looking for safe spots. Well, it looks like he, there's a safe spot. He's found that safe spot. Uh, I might go here, give him that one, and then it forces him to give me one. Okay. And then you keep doing this going back and forth, back and forth until uh, all the lines are filled up and they keep, you see, we keep exchanging back and forth. And whoever ends up with the most boxes at the end is the winner. Okay. You can change, of course, how big you want this to be, how difficult the computer is. Um, but it's a great, great game and lots of fun. All right. So good luck.